What's up, everybody? Do you ever remember when you were a kid and you saw another child that had something that was awesome and cool and you wanted it? Made you a little jealous, right? I've seen this beer on Instagram and on Facebook on just about every form of social media that you could see it on. And I was jealous. The can art's cool, the name's cool, and the look of the beer is very cool. And nothing but rave reviews for this double IPA. I have a can of Ghost in the Machine. My name is Josh, and you're watching Half Ass Beer Review. Beer Review is the show where you don't have to be an expert to know what's going on. I'm not an expert, and I don't want to be. I just want to drink beer and have fun doing it. So let's get into this review. Ghost in the Machine is a double IPA, clocks in at 8.5% ABV and a whopping 100 IBUs. This beer is going to punch me directly in my tongue, and I cannot wait. This beer is brewed by Parish Brewing Company in Broussard, Louisiana. I was checking their website out, and I didn't see anything for food. That could just be due to COVID reasons. I'll put a link down below. You can check out the other beers they have. Just a couple. Uh, they have a double dry hopped Ghost in the Machine. So this beer, but double dry hopped. And they also have a Rising Hope Um uh, Beer Liner Weiss, fruited with raspberries, blood orange, and Bulgaria rose. Not sure what Bulgaria rose is, but I'm sure it's delicious because it's fruited. It's a Beer Liner Weiss. It's one of those fruit beers that that I love. It's the trend. Deal with it if you don't like it. It's just what I'm into right now. No apologies from me. But now, let's talk about this can art. This can art is awesome. There's a skull on the front of this can, and its brain is basically hops. And it looks like there's a red dot on one side, and on the other side, its hops are getting blown out of its head. This beer is kind of deep, or at least the name's deep. Um, Ghost in the Machine is a philosophical term that I've only kind of skimmed. It seems like a rabbit hole that I need to go down when I'm not trying to do beer reviews because it's just going to take up all of my time. Basically, the idea of it is dualism. So the ghost is our brain, and in this case of the can art, the hops, and the machine is just our body. So the idea is just this ghost entity living inside and maneuvering our body around. Like I said, I don't know a lot about it. If you know more about it, go ahead and comment and tell me just how ignorant I am on this topic. Uh, but enough about the can art and philosophy that most of us probably don't understand. Let's open up this can. Let's pour it, look at it, smell it, and finally taste it to get you your rating. Beautiful crack, as always. Oh, God, look at the beautiful pour on this beer. Not trying to toot my own horn. I'm talking about the color of the beer itself. I can already smell it. I can already smell those hops. This is 100 IBUs. Like I said, this beer is going to punch me in the tongue. I'm going to go ahead and smell it. Well, I'm going to get closer and smell it some more. How's that sound? Sounds good to me. Uh, quick look at the head. Very minimal, less than a finger. Oh, man. Citrusy, grapefruity smelling. Uh, you can really smell those hops. I mean, just looking at that murkiness of the beer. Oh, I'm really excited to try this beer. Let's do that right now. As always, on half ass Beer Review, I go little drink, big drink. Cheers, everybody. Thank you.
So this beer is not hitting me like I thought it would with all those bitters. It's there. Believe me, the bitterness is there. But this beer is delicious. It's just... It's a delicious beer. It coats your mouth. The flavor's lasting. It's just this delicious, like, hot profile that sits on your tongue. You don't want it to go away. And you want to keep drinking this beer. I got this beer in the Tavor box. I saw it on there. And like I said, I was a jealous little kid seeing all those people on social media drinking this beer. And I was like, I'm definitely going to buy this beer. And that's what I did. And now it's here. And I'm so happy that it is. Let me take another drink of this beer and I will give you a rating. This is a really good beer. This is one of the better double IPAs I think I've had. I'm going to give it another drink and get you my rating. Man. So delicious and so just full of flavor. No, I said I'm going to give you another drink and get a rating, but I'm going to take another drink because it's just that good. I love this beer. I love all of this beer. Oh, man. Cheers again, everybody. Out of six, this beer is easily 5.8. I love everything about this beer. 100 IBUs ain't nothing. I think everything about this beer just works really well together. It's a very well-balanced beer. Delicious. It doesn't feel like 8.5%. It's just, man, it's hard to describe, but I love this beer. Parish Brewing, Broussard, Louisiana. Shout out to you guys for brewing this beer. I need to get my hands on that double dry hopped just to see how well it follows up with this. I'm kind of speechless at how good this beer is after just saying that. I guess I just end this now unless you guys want to sit here and watch me finish this beer, which I know nobody wants to. Because uh, after a certain amount of time, dumb stuff starts coming out of my mouth. Now, that's going to do it for this episode of Half-Ass Beer Review. Ghost in the Machine, Parish Brewing. If you can get it, you definitely need to do that. Shout out to those guys again for making such a high quality double IPA. I did Hop Slam the other day, and this just blows the socks off of it. I, I would pick this over any other IPA that I would see sitting there. Um, I didn't check the date on this. 112520. All right, so this beer is a month and a half old. You know, three months for an IPA. That's mostly the time frame. So we're about halfway through that. And this beer's still kicking. If you liked this video, please give it a thumbs up. If you haven't subscribed already, please do so now. Keeps you up to date whenever I post a new video. And if you like this video and you know someone that wants to see it, please go ahead and share it. I promise you, I won't mind if you do. Go ahead, like my other forms of social media. Facebook, Instagram, and YouTube at Half Ass Beer Review. My name's Josh. Have a great night.